I've been working uh, in MS research for over 35 years. From PhD student to grandpa, I've been trying to find these MS genes. It's very exciting that we're, we're almost there. There's an old saying in science, that if you want to make little steps, compete. If you want to make giant leaps, collaborate. Getting funding for young researchers is really very difficult. So when I got the funding, I was so excited and it was almost like winning a lottery because it's just so hard to get funding. MS has been around for the last 150 years and it's still a disease that we're not able to solve it. So I guess there's a need for more funding for young researchers like us. And I guess the future for MS Research Australia is going to be bright. Without them, I don't think that this bio biomarker discovery can even happen. MS Research Australia has created a fantastic uh, atmosphere of collaboration. I know that we have achieved a lot and I think multiple sclerosis is one of the few areas in medicine where there has been dramatic advances, especially therapeutic options. There is a lot more work that needs to be done. We might not have yet a cure for multiple sclerosis, but we are very, very close. The advancements in treatment have been really significant. I know going from injections to oral medication is a fantastic advancement in research. Knowing that someone is out there doing something to ease my pain or to increase our quality of life is amazing. We've found the susceptibility genes, now we want to find the progression genes. There's so many reasons to think that the trail that we're on is a good one. We expect to find ways of predicting who will respond to which therapy. We will see over the next 10 years probably 10 times the discovery of the past 10 years and that is just going to be wonderful. I look forward to it.